What's the deal, YouTube? It's your boy Hoodie from the Hood, aka your friend from that big old end. Hollering at y'all once again. I doubled up on y'all today. I know y'all like, man, he just dropped a video a couple hours ago. Yes, I did. I'm back, nigga. Because it's something that I wanted to get off my chest. Um, Y'all got to stop telling people all your business. I know a lot of you motherfuckers is close to people and that's cool. But there is nobody on this earth that should know every single thing about you. I mean... 85% cool, 90% cool. There ain't nobody on this motherfucking earth besides probably your parents. If you got that relationship with them, there ain't no way that somebody should know every single thing that you do. That shit is not cool. Anybody who knows everything about you holds power over you. And a lot of times you going to fall out with some of these motherfuckers and they going to tell your business. They gonna tell all your fucking business, homie. Some of you motherfuckers be telling your homies, um, like whatever little bitch you fucking on, knowing damn well you got a girlfriend. That nigga gonna backdoor you and vice versa. Some of you bitches be telling your homegirls what y'all doing or she didn't seen you do some shit when you didn't got mad at your nigga or whatever. Whole time she gonna backdoor you. She wanna fuck with your nigga. Or she just want to fuck up what you got going on. She might not even like your nigga. But if y'all fall out and y'all have a big ass argument, she going to throw your ass under the bus. Because y'all be telling motherfuckers all your fucking business, homie. You got to keep some shit close to the chest. And it's just that simple. Motherfucker. And then, and then some of you motherfuckers, y'all want to stop fucking with certain people. But you know they got dirt on you. So now you don't want to get rid of this person because you know that they know all your deepest, darkest secrets. Should have kept your motherfucking mouth shut. Ain't no way you should have let that person know all that shit about you. Now what you going to do? You going to be stuck with a motherfucker forever because you don't want them to divulge that information? Hmm? You might have committed a crime with, with a motherfucker. And you feel like if y'all fall out, that motherfucker gonna go to the police. Or you told a motherfucker some shit. And then they get cracked later on down the line and they wanna save they self. That's how you niggas is getting cracked. Cause you didn't told this motherfucker when y'all was cool 10 years ago. Y'all fell out today. He catch a case two months from now. He throw you under the bus. Stop running your motherfucking mouth. Stop telling people all your business. A lot of you niggas, check this out. A lot of you niggas, and I'm quite sure females, but I'm just speaking from the nigga side of things because I just, you know, know how people operate. A lot of you niggas be showing your homies little videos and, and pictures of your girl. Or you telling your homie how good her head is or how good her pussy is. That nigga want to fuck your bitch now. He probably already wanted to fuck her. He looking at her when she walked by like, oh, she got ass. Big ass titties, cuz. And you put the icing on the cake. Talking about, oh, yeah, yeah, that bitch, that bitch pussy wet. Oh, she be creaming. Talking too much. You go to jail and you wonder how they start a little fling. Vice versa. Y'all telling y'all homegirl too much shit about your man. Y'all telling y'all homegirl how good he be fucking you. Now she want to fuck your nigga. She want to come find out. Because y'all run y'all mouth too much. Even even in the beginning, like you could just start talking to a, to a female or you can start talking to a nigga right now and you ain't got no feelings for that person yet. So you telling them everything. Fast forward a couple months. Now you got feelings for that person. But you already said what you said and it's already it's already in their head. It's already in their head. Now you don't want nobody to look at your girl. But when you just knocked this bitch within the first week or two, you were showing everybody the pussy pictures she was sending you. 
or the dick pics, vice versa, whatever y'all, whatever. That shit crazy. Y'all gotta, y'all gotta, man, y'all gotta keep shit to yourself. Period. Because motherfucker will use that against you. Anything you say can and will be used against you in the court of they motherfucking opinion. And they can use it at their discretion whenever they want to. It's kind of like blackmail. Somebody got a gang of dirt over your head and they just like, yeah, remember you told me that shit? You wonder how the whole motherfucking city know your business. Because you trusted in the wrong person. Why? Because y'all got high together? Because y'all got drunk? Because y'all sniffed some powder? And y'all vented to each other? Y'all told each other dark secrets because y'all under the influence? Then you sober up and you be like, damn, I shouldn't have said that. But whoop de whoop cool. I, I, don't think, I don't think he or she would do that. You out your motherfucking mind, player. Get it together, man. Just a little PSA from... Your boy hoodie from the hood, you know, your friend from that big old end. I wouldn't be your friend from that big old end if I didn't put you up on game, man. Stop telling people all your business. Keep some shit to yourself. Anyways, yeah. Thanks for all the support, man. Like, subscribe, share, comment, hit that notification. Tell another friend about it. This shit real over here, homie. You know, I'm going to keep dropping this shit on y'all every chance I get, whenever I feel like it, man. And I felt like it. But yeah, I'll holla at y'all. Like, bug.